Ahoy folks, Tris here with a quick news update on E3. Yes, yes, I know, we're still talking about this. It was announced this morning that the ESA, who run E3, and ReadPop, who run PAX, have gone separate ways. You may recall that back in June 2022, it was announced that ReadPop would be working to help produce E3 2023 and beyond, signing into a multi-year contract with the ESA over the annual June show. Well, now, a little over a year later, after E3 2023 failed to manifest into anything, really, the two have ended their agreement. So we will never actually see a ReadPop produced E3 event. And especially being announced just after a very strong PAX West, that's a little sad, frankly. Beyond this, it's also been announced that if there is a physical E3 event in 2024, it will not be in the Los Angeles Convention Center where it's normally held. Plans for E3 2024 aren't cancelled, so that means if it happens, it'll either be somewhere else entirely, or back online again. Supposedly, the ESA is working on a complete reinvention of E3 for 2025. It's a bit far off, but I guess we'll see what the future holds for that. But, at the very least, Mr. Jeff Keighley made sure once again to remind us all that Summer Game Fest will be back in LA next June. So, hey, at least there's that to look forward to. But what do you guys think? Are you upset that we never ended up getting a ReadPop produced E3 event? Let us know your thoughts down in the comments below, and stay tuned to Game is Playing for plenty more on gaming news. Until next time, farewell.